Welcome to use Polar Vantage V2. In this video, we'll go through the different watch faces and the new display color theme selection for Polar Vantage V2. The Polar Vantage V2 watch faces tell a lot more than just the time. You'll get the most timely and relevant information right on the watch face, including your activity status, cardio load status, heart rate, latest training sessions, nightly recharge status, Fitspark on demand training suggestions weather forecast, and your weekly training summary. V2 supports up to eight different watch faces. In the Watch Face Views menu, you can easily choose the watch faces you would like to see on the display. Tap the display and choose the views you would like to see, and tap Save. You can also customize your Polar Vantage V2 by choosing different watch faces and colors from a set of predefined styles. To modify your watch face, go to Settings and choose Watch Settings. Tap Watch Face and choose Digital or Analog. Options are available for both watch faces. Choose the watch style from the predefined options. Then choose the color you want to use. Next, let's have a look at the V2 watch face views more closely. In the Activity view, the bar around the display and the percentage below the time and date show your progress towards your daily activity goal. When opening the details, you can see more about your day's accumulated activity. Cardio load status helps you to understand how your training sessions strain your body. Cardio load status looks at the relation between your short-term training cardio load strain and long-term training load tolerance. When using the continuous heart rate feature, your watch continuously measures your heart rate and displays it on the heart rate watch face. You can also follow what are the highest and lowest heart rate readings of your day. In the latest training sessions view, you can see the time passed since your latest training session and the sport of the session. Tapping the display shows you summaries of your training sessions from the last 14 days. Nightly Recharge is an overnight recovery measurement, which offers an easy and simple way to see how your body recovers from training and stress. Tap ANS or Sleep Charge to get a detailed breakdown of your sleep and recovery. In addition, Nightly Recharge helps you to learn how to improve your nighttime recovery. The Fitspark view suggests the most suitable training targets for you based on your training history, fitness level, and current recovery status. Fitzbar keeps your training versatile, with different types of daily workouts to choose from. Tap the watch face to see all the suggested training options, and tap one of them to see the details. The weather watch face shows the current day's hourly forecast, and helps you prepare for weather changes when planning your daily outdoor activities. Tap the display to see tomorrow's 3-hour, and the day after tomorrow's 6-hour forecast. Other weather information includes, for example, wind speed, wind direction, humidity, and rain. The new weekly training summary watch face shows an overview of your training week. Your total training time for the week, split into different training zones, is illustrated on the display. When opening the details, you'll see distance, training sessions, total calories, and time spent in each heart rate zone. In addition, you'll see last week's status and any sessions planned for next week. Hope you enjoy your Polar Vantage V2.
With Bevo Fit 4, working towards your fitness and wellness goals can become part of everyday life. In this video, you'll get to know your new activity tracker and how to get the most out of it. When you take Vivo Fit 4 out of the box, press the button to turn it on. It will be in pairing mode. Now is a great time to complete the easy setup process. The Garmin Connect mobile app will walk you through how to pair, sync, and start a timed activity with your device. Once this process is complete, your activity tracker will sync your activity tracking data so you can review in the app. Let's take a look at your device. This is the home screen. If you've been sitting still for a while, you'll see a colored bar on the top of the screen called the move bar. It will continue to fill up the longer you've been inactive. You'll hear an alert reminding you that it's time to move. You can view more information and activity tracking data by pressing the button to start scrolling through your widgets. Widgets show the current date, the number of steps you've taken for the day, the number of steps needed to reach your daily step goal, distance traveled, calories burned, your total weekly intensity minutes, weather, and your custom text. Remember, you can turn widgets on or off and change their order in the app. Press and hold the key to bring up menu options. Here you can manually sync data to Garmin Connect, start a timed activity, set a timer, start a stopwatch, find your phone, start a toe-to-toe -to -toe step challenge, and view device information. Vivo Fit 4 has a few other handy features. For example, it can automatically detect activities with Move IQ. If you walk, run, swim, cycle, or even use an elliptical machine for at least 10 minutes, it will automatically record the event so you can see it in your Garmin Connect timeline. Auto Goal is another great feature which lets your device set a new daily step goal automatically based on your previous activity level. When you meet this daily goal, it will start to increase, encouraging you to take more steps every day. VivoFit 4 also offers tons of ways to customize your device with color themes, unique watch faces, and the ability to add your personal phrases to the screen. To start, open the Garmin Connect mobile app and tap on the VivoFit 4 icon. Then tap Device Settings. Select Display Options, then Watch Face to choose from a variety of designs. In the Display Options menu, you can also select Color Themes to choose what color accents you'd like to appear in widgets and on your watch face. Want to add your favorite phrase or a personal mantra for some extra motivation? Under Device Options, tap Custom Widget and then enter your desired text in the space provided. Exit all the way out of Settings. You'll be able to see your custom text widget in the loop after you complete a sync. The track is probably one of the worst locations for GPS performance, despite running around a wide open field. Since the watch is always on one side of your body as you go around the track, the GPS signal is always at least partially blocked, causing measurement errors. While the error after one lap may be small, this error is magnified by the number of laps and can add up to a significant discrepancy. Koros engineers were given the task to develop a technology that finally works on the track, 
giving athletes the most accurate distance data and GPS path from your Coros watch. To use this feature, simply select Track Run activity on your Coros watch. Choose your desired lane and hit the Start button. The watch uses the first lap to identify you are actually running on a track and will apply the track running algorithm from the second lap on. If you run from your home or your car to the track as a warm-up, feel free to still use track mode for the full run, as the segment not on the track will be measured as regular running. Meanwhile, you can also switch lanes in the middle of your workout. If you set 400 meters as the auto lap, your watch will beep at nearly the same spot on every lap during your track run. This is a completely new experience for runners who train on the track. That's it. Easy and simple for the most accurate training data from your track runs.